because you know people you know because you know people you know people are different you know what i'm saying uh, you know people you know people are different you know people move you know people move different it's like how you know like i said about everybody you know uh giving their opinions about you know about sassy trucker situation you know uh unfortunately it's just a lot of people that's picking up the story that really don't know her all that well i mean i i don't know her all that well either i mean i i you know i had her on the i had her on the channel for at least a you know about a good dozen of times and the conversations that we had was always great you know so i never you know i never had no 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 bad uh conversations with her or anything like that you know so but again you know her situation is different and if that was me you know i you know from the offset i probably wouldn't have never happened never let anybody take my personal belongings in the beginning anyway so but that's again that's just me you know if i I've been in plenty of accidents and the first thing that I, you know, I grab is keys, wallet, <laughs> and uh, cell phone. You know, back then, you know, I'm from the old school, you know, back then it was the keys and wallet, but now keys, wallet, cell phone, you know, there's no, there's no reason to, unless I was hurt in the accident that i couldn't do anything and they put me in the ambulance you know what i'm saying and take me to the hospital then yes that that will be the only reason why my personal belongings will be left behind but if i'm able to get out of the car or truck for that matter yeah keys wallet and cell phone is coming with me <laughs> you know what i'm saying so i i, I don't you know that's I, I don't know i i don't know what was the reason why her personal belongings was left behind in the first place see that's that's part of the story that we you know that we're not getting you know what i'm saying what was the what was the reason why it was left behind in the first place you know so i i i guess when we get that part of the story then we'll probably be able to get a better understanding of what's of what's going on because you know it is true you know and it, it's not just dubai it's, it's it's not just dubai man it's it's all over you know all over these foreign countries you go to you you go to you go to some places that you're not familiar with there's always going to be somebody that's going to try to take advantage of you try to extort you and 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 try to do something to get something out of you you know they they don't know that you know if i'm rich or wealthy or anything like that they just assume that i am because i'm 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 from a different you know different part of the world I come there, I, I come there and, and, you know, visit your country, try to, you know, try to take in the culture and everything. And there's always, there's always somebody there that's trying to take advantage of you. They don't know that I'm, that I'm a rich millionaire or, 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 or a poor truck driver, you know, and, but they're going to, they're going to try, they're going to try you you know what i'm saying they 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 gonna try you because that's that's what they do you know they they they, they gonna try you you know you go over there and you you know you would think your 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 meal is is 10 15 dollars and then all of a sudden they bring you the check and it's like 50 bucks like yeah we gotta charge you for sitting here and we gotta we, we gotta charge you for using the silverware and you know and even the water cost ten dollars like bro i i was told wait a minute what you talking about 
I was told that the meal here was 15. You, you charging an extra $35, my guy. <laughs> what you doing? Oh, and and if you don't and if you don't pay, you know, we gonna call the cops and and the cops is gonna come there and and instead of the cops being on your side, because you the cops know that you being distorted, but they getting the piece of it. They they get the piece of it. Like they 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 right outside. They they right around the corner. They they can smell uh 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 travelers visitors they could smell us a mile away they saw your ghetto ass coming from miles away nigga they could see us coming a mile away you you seen how that you i, I don't know if you watch the wire or anything like that but you 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 seen how 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 clay davis finessed this stringer bell this one time, I had this fella named Bell hooked up on this Howard Street condo thing. Got it so he wasn't running his shit past a lawyer. Boy, I tell you, we bled that motherfucker. They saw that boy coming a mile away. <laughs> so that's that's how the, that's how these places are, man. They they see us coming a mile away, and they you know they got they they got they they got the laws in their pocket, man. Like so many nickels and dimes. I need Don Corleone, those politicians that you carry in your pocket. Like so many nickels and dimes. You know, they got they got them in their pocket and we, you know, we try to try to plead our case with who we think that's supposed to protect and serve. But they protecting and serve it because they getting the cut of it. So yeah, you're gonna have to come out of your pocket some kind of way. You you gonna pay? It's unfortunate, but you're gonna pay one way or the other. You you either gonna pay with money, or you're gonna pay with time. And and you know and I mean I agree. I agree to disagree with some people out here saying that you gotta you gotta learn the laws and stuff like that. But yeah, you do. Yeah, you do. See, you you use all of this as a teachable moment. You know, now I a lot of stuff I I didn't know. I I, I see everybody saying Dubai is all this great place and spectacular place and Right, you on the beach, water, water crystal clear. You can see right down to the ocean floor. You know, everybody, you know, everybody, everybody's having a good time. Buildings is nice, culture is nice, and and everything. But I, I, I hey, I didn't know that uh, the women over there didn't have that much laws i mean because it's plenty of women that goes over there so you would think you know it, it will be lightweight equal but yeah come to find out you can't even bring a sex toy over in dubai put that coffee down it's uh it's it's a it's it's a pipe dream that you know it, it it's a pipe dream and and these Instagram models, they 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 are uh, vulnerable. You know, they they all on Instagram, showing off their goods and all like that. You got you 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 got men from all over the world looking at your Instagram pictures and all like that. That's why I don't. That, that's why I don't see where the term Instagram model came from. Like. Bro, just because you in a just because you in a two-piece bathing suit, you're not a model. <laughs> These Instagram females that that just be posting in two-piece bathing suits and sitting there with they wide, I mean with they legs all wide open and then and, and they cons consider themselves a models, those are the vulnerable ones, bro. 
those are the ones that that these that these porter potty dudes is looking for those are the ones that sitting there you know like that that don't have no money working at burger king and stuff like that and then when somebody like somebody from dubai is over here talking about yo i could sponsor you you know get you a visa uh get you about uh ten thousand dollars uh fifty fifty thousand dollars or whatever whatever they they spend that that's how they spend it they ain't going to tell you the reason what the the real reason why they want you to come over there they're going to they're going to spin it they're going to be like they're going to be like yeah you know we'll we'll fly you out here and you will have a, a beautiful time you can lay up in my palace and this that and the third and 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 them vulnerable women to fall for that it's the old it's the old saying what would you do for money you know what, what would you do for money you know so when they get out there under that pretense because you know they're gonna have to send them maybe about 10k or or you know just to entice them because i'm sure they're not gonna they're they're not gonna uh get on up out there that's why apps like cash app and vimo and and paypal is very popular right now you know because back then you know you'll have to get all your money up when you get there you know but at least now you could be like hey you know vimo me half my money and and the rich dude to be like yeah 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 i got you i got you you get all the way out there you get all the way out there and and, and the first couple of days is going to be good uh, yeah they're going to treat you they're going to treat you nice they're going to treat you great they're going to take you to you know the top spots and all like that but then the real nitty gritty comes out hey um so for an extra 50k uh what, what do you think about me uh letting me shit in your mouth say what 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 is, nah man i ain't nah nah of course you will put up a little little hesitation you're gonna be like nah man that's nasty and this that and the third and all like that but when 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 the money start coming into play well, how about, you know, you, you're not going to do it for 50K? No, I ain't, I'm not doing it at all. How about for 100K? I, I, hmm. Hmm. Uh, 100, uh, 100, 100, 100K? 100 US dollars? Yes, yes, 100 US dollars. Uh. You 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 got that money on you right now? Got the money right here in the briefcase. Will anybody know about it? No, nah, no, nah, no, no, nobody would never know about it. Nobody would never know about it. Are are you sure? I'm positive. Then you go ahead and degrade yourself. Of course, somebody's gonna know about it. Of course, this this the modern times, bro everybody got a fucking camera man dude got a camera set up somewhere in his room or in 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 the living room or in the office wherever the fuck he's at he got a camera you know you being recorded that dude gonna want something of his exploits that he actually got a vulnerable guttable money hungry female to do that and he wants to he wants to have it on video and you know it's going to be on video now when you get back over to the states after you feel all degraded and all like that but you got your money you know you could probably put that behind you but then when you go on the on the website and websites like ghetto gaggers and and it's play and it's font got uh videos of females doing the porta potty quote unquote challenge because this is it's a challenge over here it's everything when you when you do something it has to be a challenge over here so 
they they make it as the porta potty challenge and guess whose picture video is all on you now you're now now you're you know you're you 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 you're out you're you're ousted you're and now you're going on a sympathy tour talking about oh what i was made up you know i was i was captured i was kidnapped and, and they forced me to do this that and the third but you're leaving out the money part though <laughs> you know what i'm saying you you you're leaving out the money part so yeah you know a lot of these females uh males too i'm not gonna leave the males out so you know that if they was getting paid right of course they're gonna you know but some of them you know these days don't even get paid because they don't know but but yeah the dudes you know don't don't let me leave the, the dudes out because the dudes do the same thing they do the same thing for money if some if some rich guy <laughs> if some rich guy gets you hemmed up and in Abu Dhabi or some shit like that. And he'd be like, yo, let me shit in your mouth for, you know, for like 200K, a million dollars. An indecent proposal, you know? Of course, you're gonna go back and forth. And when you get home, you're gonna be like, yeah, I need the money, you know? And, but just realize when you, when you do some ill shit. Your coffee is normally made by Cato. Who the hell is that? He works on your father's cars and, and makes his coffee. You fired him and everyone else who works for your father yesterday. I want Kato here now. If you do crazy stuff for money, out of the ordinary stuff for money, just just know it's gonna be uh, just know it's gonna be out there, <laughs> you know. It or it it may not be over in the states yet, but. The snow is out there, you know, and a lot of people over here talking about the porta potty, porta potty challenge and stuff like that. I mean, you know, like I said, things you you just don't know what what, what crazy things be going down with these rich dudes. Uh, you know, they, psh, you know, these guys with billions and billions of dollars of money, they don't know what to do with themselves. You know, so I'm just saying, man, that's. That's crazy. Big cheese got it locked, boy. Want you to love me all night, yeah, take me down. Want you to make me real way, yeah, swim around. Want you to take it like a G, and yeah, I'll make a sound. And I want you to miss me when I'm not around. Come dive in my ocean, for my push. My love is like lotion. It's all over you. You all over me, cause you my little boo. How many times I gotta tell you, don't fuck around. The stick got you, Mr. Cree, me, your feelings now.